Hello, we've got Joshua's tricky questions here. So the first question is, how many kilometres is two centimetres on a 1 to 250,000? So it's 1 to 250,000. Now, treat yourself, use your written workings. So that means that one bogey on the map equals 250,000 bogeys in real life. One inch on the map is 250,000 inches in... Ooh, the spider's just popped down. Go away. It's big. No, go away. Shoo. <sighs> Wasn't expecting that. Hang on. <sighs> this on the floor. Uh, right. Where would we got to? One inch equals 250,000 inches. It just shows you how much it shrunk. And you can use any unit you like. So long as you use the same on this side as this side. So therefore we know that one centimetre equals 250,000 centimetres in real life. But you wouldn't go around measuring that kind of distance, would you? Ooh, driven a centimetre, driven another centimetre, driven another centimetre, driven another centimetre. Get a bit tedious, wouldn't it? So we use it in different units. So we go centimetres, decimetres, metres, decimetres, hectometres, kilometers. So we now we know that one centimeter equals 2.5 kilometers. Now I'll go over that little rhyme in a moment, just bear with me. One centimeter equals 2.5 kilometers, therefore two centimeters equals five kilometers. Uh, happy so far? Uh, one Mars bar costs two pounds fifty, two Mars bars cost five pounds. So there's your answer. Now, how do we remember the, it goes, kilometres, hectometres, decimeters. notice all capitals, metres, decimeters, centimetres, millimetres. Ten of those equals that. Ten centimetres equals a decimetre. Ten decimetres equals a metre. Ten metres equals a decimetre. Ten decimetres equals a hectometre. Ten hectometres equals a kilometre. Now, a millimetre, there are a thousand of those in a metre. Uh, millennium has got a thousand years in it. A century has got a hundred years. hundred centimetres in a metre. Uh, deci, um, when the Romans decimated a village, they killed every tenth person. A decimetre is a tenth of a metre. Decade has got ten years in it, so that's ten metres. A hectare is a unit of land a hundred metres by a hundred metres. So it's 100 metres and a kilometre. You know that's a 1,000 metres, don't you? King Henry died. Mother didn't care much. I also works for grams. King Henry died. Granny didn't care much. And it works for litres. King Henry died. Lady didn't care much. It works more often, though. You're going to have to do it this way. Many children dread mother dropping her knickers. Well, you would, wouldn't you? Uh, or for grams, many children dread granny dropping her knickers. Now this is less grammatically elegant, but let's be honest, we left elegance out the window years ago, didn't we? Many children dread lady dropping her knickers. So just jot it down. It's easier just to remember millimetres, centimetres, decimetres, metres, decimetres, hectometres, kilometres. Don't recite it until you've learnt it properly. Otherwise, the problem you'll have is you'll learn it the wrong way around. Happy? Well done.